my name is Wolves and welcome back to another video on my channel and today we're here with a create a sim. I know today is supposed to be not so berry but I had a busy week and like I had no time to sit down and record and today is Sunday and I was like I need a kind of easy video to make so I decided to make a create a sim video and yeah so here we are tomorrow hopefully there will be a not so berry video but i know not so berry is supposed to be on mondays but i didn't have time to sit down and record and today i've been so exhausted and on top of that we had a power outage i was in the middle of creating this sim when it happened and i was shocked that my recording didn't stop like i don't know it was really weird like everything else was off but my laptop because i have a laptop was still going I had no internet connection or anything like that, but I was able to still play The Sims without any power on, which is very interesting. I didn't know that. I was sitting here creating The Sim in the dark. Uh, the power was out for a good while, and I would, I really wanted to record a Not So Berry, but I am. I, I right now I'm I, I'm trying to do this video, and I'm exhausted. I just the heat has been kicking my butt i don't know i just been so tired and then on top of that i've been have i'm like kind of like annoyed with like everything probably because i'm so exhausted so i'm like frustrated and i was just like no i don't think i can record the not so berry today because i'm so tired and i'm getting frustrated with everything so I think it was just best that I do like something simple. So I am making a sim. This sim is actually going to be used. I am going to be playing with her. I decided to try the 100 baby challenge again. Yeah, I know I did do the 100 baby challenge and then I got to, I don't know, how many I got to, but I got to maybe not even, I don't know, like I can't remember if it was like the halfway point or we weren't even close to the halfway point, I can't remember. But I remembered I started doing the 100 baby challenge, I got to a certain point and then I got tired of the 100 baby challenge. You know what I should have done? Instead of rushing it like I did, I should have like spaced it out and slowly done the 100 baby challenge because I watch people who done the 100 baby challenge in the past and they slowly did the 100 baby challenge it took somebody four years to get through the 100 baby challenge and one girl she I think it was like two almost three years before she got through the 100 baby challenge but yeah, so I decided that I'm going to do the 100 baby challenge again and as you can tell I made her a teenager. I am actually going to make her a teenager because I am actually going to do this in short lifespan version. So this is the 100 baby challenge short lifespan challenge. Um, I'm not gonna be following any rules. Not the, I'm not gonna follow the 100 baby rules. Nothing like that. I'm gonna do it my way and just have fun with it. So I thought maybe one day I can like randomize how many babies she's gonna have and then cheat it so she can have so many babies. Um, but I won't do that like all the time. Just like once in a while I'll probably do that. But I thought that would be kind of interesting if I just like, oh, today is the day that I'm going to randomize how many babies she's going to have. We can have one, two, or three, and then I'll put it like in a little spin wheel thing and spin the wheel and see how many the wheel is going to tell us how many she's going to have. I will put it, I will put one in there so if she, we will see if she'll end up having one baby, two, or three. So that would be kind of interesting, but yeah, so I really wanted to, to try the 100 baby challenge again, but totally different and 
what how I want to do it. See if I can get through it without losing my ever flipping mind because I know that I have in the past when I was doing the 100 baby challenge I was always frustrated because the babies would cry and cry and cry and cry and drive me up the freaking wall. So she's a teenager but I do have the preteen mod in The Sims. I do I did go ahead and set some stuff up. I was gonna record it but um by the time I got done with our girl here my battery to my laptop was starting to die and you know I was in the middle of an outage so I was like well there's no point in trying to record me doing her house and all that so like that because I won't have enough battery life to set to record that so I went and I downloaded a house off the gallery but it wasn't fully furnished so I downloaded it and furnished it and it was it had some furnish in it, but not a lot. The house is all set for the 100 baby challenge, and then I made our girl a preteen because it will give us a little bit more time to have babies and stuff like that. Because she's gonna, we're gonna be on a short lifespan. So the preteen goes for seven days, and then after that, her teenage years goes for I think six days or something like that. I'm not positive. So she'll have seven days and she'll still she'll be able to get pregnant as a preteen um, because I did make it so it was able for teens to get pregnant. So she and also aging will be frozen at the time of her being pregnant. I was going to turn it off but I thought maybe I should keep it on so she has that will add on to you know her days of giving birth because you know, people are like, oh, you need to have one sim and try to have that one sim have as many children as possible before they turn old and die. So, um, I thought that it would be kind of interesting to do a short lifespan, but make her a teenager and try to have as many kids as possible until she ages up into an old person. I don't know. And I also made it so old people can get pregnant. So even in her old age, she will still be giving birth to the children until she passes away. So that's lovely. I did make her a bookworm because I thought it would be best that she writes books. But I do have the easel so if we really need it, we can also paint. But I think I'm actually going to have our girl be freelance job of writing. So she'll do like freelance writing kind of situation. I don't know. I'll figure it out. But for right now, this is her. And I hope you guys like how she came out. I will be starting the 100 Baby Challenge in the next video, which will probably be coming out maybe this weekend or maybe next weekend. I hope you guys are excited for this new challenge. I, I actually am excited to start the 100 baby challenge again and hopefully this time I will get through it without doing it how I did it the last time which was me just randomly getting her pregnant with a whole bunch of people and then uh, cheating her into labor and all that stuff like that. Ugh. But yeah. Anyways, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give this video a thumbs up. Ring that bell if you want to see more videos from me. Subscribe if you want to. And I'll see all you beautiful night wolves in the next video. Goodbye. I can make you stay Cause baby, I 
Everything is upside down. Oh, 